kids about how sound is vibration, and one way that we can do this is using our tuning fork. And like I was saying, they're able to feel the vibration, they're able to hear the sound at the same time. Um, when we, we can demonstrate this is using our ping pong ball. If we whack our tuning fork, it's going to vibrate. And what it's going to do is bounce that ping pong ball. So the vibrations from the tuning fork are causing that to vibrate. Another thing we can do is demonstrate the difference between a soft sound and a loud sound. So we just whack it a little bit. We get small little bumps. But if we really whack it, we're going to get huge bumps. So you can see the difference between a vibration from a soft sound, which is real small, and, the, diff and um, the vibrations from a loud sound, which are much bigger. So you're able to visualize you know, how bigger vibrations and louder sounds go together. So. Okay, let me video type that right behind me. So this is. And the purpose is to teach kids about what? About how sound is vibration, what sound is. Because okay. most kids, they just hear it and they're like, okay, it's something that's going into my ear. But they don't realize that sound is really just a series of vibrations. So this is a way to teach them how to, how to visualize sound and what it is.